Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Swapna here. Hope you all are doing well. In this video, I am going to show you how to paint on yet another interesting medium that is fabric. You learn to paint this really simple yet gorgeous floral design on fabric using fabric paints. I'll be using a range of fabric paints from the brand Fevicryl and Camel and also I have this embroidery hoop to secure the fabric. This is a really freehand drawing so even if you are a beginner and new to painting you can definitely give this a try without any fear. Here with this pencil I am just fixing the positions of flowers and the leaves. So I have taken the shade of orange in my palette and I am using a size 6 round brush. And this is a straight stroke that I will be using throughout this floral design to create the petals for these flowers. If you have drawn a circle or oval shape for flowers, you just need to fill the space using these strokes. Here is a closer look of the strokes that I am making inwards. As always I like to work on various layers so here I am adding another stroke with dark red. And now a final layer of petals with the same orange shade. This will give the visual effect of a thick bunch of petals for these flowers. You can feel free to change these colors and also the pattern of these petals. In the middle portion I am adding a slightly lighter shade. For that I have mixed yellow and orange together. I am using the same technique to paint two more flowers with yellow and orange shade. Now it's time to add some green stems and leaves. With the tip of the same round brush you can add curvy vertical strokes. 
and with two shades of green you can paint these beautiful leaves. At this stage I wanted to add some background for this painting so I am diluting the green and yellow shade and mixing it very well and with a sponge I am just dabbing the diluted paint onto the background. You can try swiping it with the sponge to create this really smart effect. Make sure that the floral design is completely dried before starting this stage. I made a mistake and a few of my petals got smudged along with the background so I had to redo that portion. But this is a really easy and fun part to get this wonderful background. Here I am adding few more petals for this flower since few of it got smudged together with the background when I added the green diluted paint. Now to highlight these green stems and leaves I am adding few more strokes. Adding tiny little final details using this white. Here I am just filling out the diluted paint on these borders as well. Since it's small portion I can use brush. And this is how our painting is looking in the morning light. I really like the vibrancy of the flowers in this light green background. There are two options to use it, one as a wall hanging and one as a patchwork for any of your dress. If you are using it as a wall hanging, you can use this embroidery hoop as well so that you can hang it directly on the wall. So I am just cutting out these excess fabric. After tightening the hoop really well, you can hang it directly onto the wall and this doesn't need any other framing. Or else you can turn this into a wearable art 
you can give a beautiful makeover to any of your tops or dresses. You need to cut out this exact circular design part and fix it onto the top using a fabric glue or stitch it really well on this position. So if you like this video, please don't forget to like, comment and share this video. And if you are new here, please consider joining the family by pressing that subscribe button. Thank you.